Welcome back dear children to e-learning classes standard 7 subject english chapter number 2 exploring puzzles activity 2 birbal was able to solve the emperor's puzzle because he thought clearly and realistically about the emperor's question he did not make assumption now what is assumption assumption is something that is believed to be true without any evidence sometimes making an assumption is correct but sometimes it is wrong so before saying we should think correctly about the problem and then only we should say the answer now in this box you have to write what did the courtiers assumed what did they assume the courtiers assumed that some mischief maker or an evil man must have played that mischief with the king of kings and he should be punished he should not be pardoned at any cost anybody who dared to do so must be killed that will be the only right deserving punishment for him In the second box we have to write which line in the story help you to know what the courtiers were thinking Now those line you have to write for example first one is only the most foul criminal would dare to touch the king Second this villain should be mercilessly flogged to death Third beheaded in full public view and fourth one the villain should be thrown down from the fort or be hanged the third activity is an old joke you read it out it is based on assumption now we move to activity 4 it is a puzzle taken from means adapted from the book called the canterbury puzzles and other curious problems by henry ernest dunay in this book there are many puzzles one we will read it out now long ago there was an inn where pilgrims often stopped on their way to worship at a famous shrine shrine is a place where people worship during the long evening as they rested from their journey they would tell stories and sometimes amuse each other with games and puzzles on one evening the company all turned to the pardoner now who is this pardoner the pardoner is a person who forgives the sins of others in return he gets the money like pujari we give dakshina to pujari to do the prayers for us the pardoner's puzzle the gentle pardoner who had just arrived very tired all the way from rome begged to be excused but the company would not spare him friends and fellow pilgrims said he truly the puzzle i've made is a poor thing but it's the best that i have been able to create blame my lack of knowledge of such matter if you don't like it but this invention was very well received he produced the accompanying plan and said that it symbolized 64 towns through which he had to pass during some of his pilgrimage he said the lines connecting the towns represents road he explained that to solve the puzzle one has to start from the large black town and visit all the other towns once and once only in 15 straight lines with your pencil he said you may end where you like but note that a little road at the bottom has been omitted intentionally and it is impossible to go that way now dear children read the story carefully and understand the instruction and then solve the puzzle
नेक्स्ट इज दी एक्टिविटी फाइव रीड द स्टोरी अगेन वन मोर पजल वन डे वॉकिंग इन द गार्डन विद बीरबल एंड द अदर कोट यार्ड्स एम्पर अकबर बेंड टू पिक अप अ शार्प स्टोन विद इट ही ड्रू अ लाइन ऑन द ग्राउंड एंड सेड बीरबल मेक दिस लाइन शॉर्टर he paused and with a glint of mischief in his eyes he said but don't touch it just make it shorter the courtiers looked at each other birbal surely couldn't do this could he perhaps he would finally be outwitted but birbal calmly bent down to pick up another stone he quietly draw a second line below akbar's everyone looked at the two lines akbar's line was clearly shorter than birbal so what did birbal do he just drew a bigger line than akbar there was a brief silence then akbar smiled i thought i had outsmarted you this time but you have done it again hope dear children you understood this activity thank you for watching the video